What's up guys, today we're gonna do a pretty cool little density demonstration with a water bottle, some vegetable oil, and some water. So I thought we'd use this principle to make a neat little display, a rainbow density display. Let's go. And by the way, I'm just using some standard food colorings to get some nice colors added to the water. That way we can create this beautiful rainbow display.
That's pretty cool, honestly, the little rainbow density display. I like it. All right, so I think that's pretty cool, just making a neat little density display out of some oil and water and a little bit of food coloring, you know, to spice things up a little bit. And it's definitely something you can try at home. All this is perfectly safe. It's just using some vegetable oil that we use for cooking, a little bit of water and some food coloring. It all mixed together in a bottle and got something pretty epic. Plus then you can play with the colors and I just used some little glass bottles that I had laying around, but it's so much fun. They're really neat to play with and the kids love them. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed that. I know it was pretty simple, but I wanted to show you something fun that you guys could do at home with the kids and something that, you know, turns into a fun little craft project. Cause you end up with all kinds of little bottles of density things going on. It's, it's fun though, trust me, it's really cool. Some people might even argue that they make good stress relievers just cause they're a ton of fun to play with. Oh, and we're celebrating 200 subscribers. Yes, that's right, it happened last week. I got a little bit above 200 subscribers, which I am super stoked about. And I thank you guys for clicking that subscribe button and sticking around and watching some cool videos. And, uh, you know, sharing these videos with uh, all your friends. Make sure you click that little share button down there, by the way, and uh, share this video. Because this one's super fun, something you can do at home that I think you're really going to like. So I hope you make one of these at home, they're a ton of fun and I think you'll enjoy it as well. Cool things coming up in the near future, make sure you're subscribed right down over here. Click the little button and uh, that'll get you subscribed. That way you'll know about all the new videos that I make and you know I do make something new every Monday just for you guys. So uh, you know, come back next week. Anyway I hope you had fun, if you did make sure you smash that like button down there. Don't forget to subscribe again and uh, leave me a little comment. Let me know what you think or if you build one of these at home, uh, maybe you're going to take it to the next level. That's what I want to see. Uh, so share that down below if you do something crazy like that. And really, aside from that, I'll catch you guys next time.